I'm encouraged that th that whole notion of, you know, being a man and or sort of defining what that means is changing. When I was coming of age, this whole idea of, of being a man was, you know, to, to tough it out and, and not show emotion and to have no weaknesses and to be mentally and physically and emotionally strong. And, and, uh, and I think now as we have, you know, come as a society to embrace uh, mental health, and particularly mental health in sports. And I think a lot of athletes um, have really helped to change that narrative by being forthcoming and honest and sharing their challenges and their struggles. You know, as a society, there's a shift going on. And, um, and part of that shift is sort of redefining what strength is. And to me, being able to admit that you're struggling, admit that you're overwhelmed at times, or you're dealing with challenges, anxiety, whatever that might be, you know, th that was frowned upon. And um, in reality, it is tremendous strength to be able to acknowledge that, to be able to accept it and look to get help. And to be able to share that, you know, with, with the entire world. Uh, I applaud athletes today who really start that conversation and start to change that narrative. And so to me, that's, you know, what, it, what exactly is, is being a male or what is exactly is being strong? Um, you know, that's change and change for the better. And I also think, you know, just the uh, LGBTQ community and, um, and certainly um, its voice, its, uh, you know, education, information that, um, and, and I guess really ultimately ability to sort of, you know, change the narrative uh, has played a role as well. And, uh, you know, there have been athletes who've come out and particularly male athletes, which, you know, 20, 30 years ago was taboo. And, and so now we are um, accepting it and embracing it more. We still have a ways to go, but I think that's played a role. And um, I think, you know, sort of, which, which it should, you know, I think every generation should continue to evolve, not just in the respective sports, but just in society overall. I, I just think it, it starts to shift and change that narrative and that definition of sort of what it is to be a man in sports.